All right, guys, we are back at you with another review. This one is one of my personal, personal favorites. favorites. This, this is, is Bone. Bone Snapper. This stuff is awesome. So I came across this stuff. I was at a work trip in Ohio. I was coming back through the Cincinnati Louisville airport. They have a cork and barrel, has a nice setup there in one of the terminals. I had some time to kill. So I just, you know, honestly, there were hundreds of bottles. I picked this one because the bottle looked cool. I tried it, had a shot, had a drink, whatever. I'm walking to my terminal, you know, five minutes away, 10 minutes away, and I texted Ken, and I was like, man, I had this awesome rye, it was really great, and he texts back immediately, did you buy it? And I was like, damn it, I did not. So I walked 10 minutes all the way back, bought this, and I tell you what, it is one of the best decisions that I made. This stuff is great, it is uh, got a lot of flavor, it's got almost like a peaty, peaty taste, which sounds kind of weird for a rye, but it's almost kind of like a Lefroig, 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 however you say it. That stuff is Lefroig, Lefroig, I don't know, but uh, I don't speak Gaelic. But, uh, <laughs> but it's a great scotch, I do love it. But this stuff is awesome. So um, Ken, tell us a little bit about it. So it's uh, bottled in Tullahoma. It's uh, a little over, it looks like it's uh, a little over six years old. It mm. says aged in months, uh, 83 months. So six and some odd years old. Mm -hmm. um, Tullahoma, Tennessee, so that means dickle, mm. right? So it says it's bottled in Tullahoma, so I'm guessing it's probably MGP. Uh, I think they just changed their name now, didn't they? I, have uh, no I think idea. they did. Yeah, Midwest Grain Products. I think there's something else huh, okay. now. Uh, and then it was bottled, so distilled in Tullahoma, Tennessee, bottled in uh, Indianapolis by Backbone Bourbon Company. Uh, this the barrel date was uh, May of 2014. They've got it. Actually, they've got all that there for you. Mm -hmm. for you. Am I on? Okay. This way. This way. Okay. Okay. And uh, and uh, uh, bottled in April of 21. So let's give this guy a shot, Dave. Yeah, I'm really excited. Let's. Uh, we're doing too much talking. I really love this stuff. You can see half the bottle is gone. Uh, this is just a, a damn good rye. It's so good. Okay, let's get after it. Yep. See what we got like I here. said, let me see that real quick. I liked the logo, but of course, you know, we'll put on this t this one. Who doesn't like Mike Tyson's punch out? You know, you got the code to fight Mike Tyson. Was it 0075935963 or something like that? I don't even remember. But I used to love the Nintendo game. The Nintendo game was the best. So I saw that. I had to buy it. So got some good legs on it, Dan. Just from yeah. the floor, we can actually see You can see, see it. Yeah, let's see it kind of. Uh, you can, see the I'm telling you guys, like I know it sounds kind of weird to say for a rye, you can smell like the peatiness in it. I know it doesn't have peat in it, but just the the aroma of it. It's definitely got a dark smell to it. Yeah, you smell some brown sugar in it. Smell some cinnamon. If you open uh, your mouth and smell, there's some gas to it. What's mm -hmm. the proof on this guy, Dan? Uh, let me see. I'm not sure off the top of my head. Uh, it's, uh, it says 59.4 proof. So I think they got it backwards. 118. 118 yeah. yeah, they think they got it backwards. Yeah, they got it backwards. So 119. <laughs> I think they were drinking too much of it that day, which I don't blame. Yeah, them. you definitely get a nice sweet smell off of it. <sighs> Stuff's so good. Can we stop talking and drink it? Yeah, this stuff is great. For it. Cheers. Cheers, guys. Is it better than the, uh, the last one? Maybe? It is definitely a hell of a lot better than Iron Smoke. Mm. Got the rye bite. To yeah, it. it's got I don't some. Know what the mash bill? Is it had the mash bill on there? I don't know. It's got some heat. So well. this is a barrel selection for cork and bottle selected. Mm. Yeah, so this is a barrel That's selection. So good. Yeah, it is good. Uh. There's definitely you get the sweet on the palate. A little bit mm. of bite, which you would expect for 118, mm. 119 mm. proof. Mm. Yeah, it doesn't have the mash bill on it. We'd have to look it that. Got up. some so, leather in the back, some cinnamon. I'm guessing if it's. Mm. Uh, I love this stuff. This is, I think uh, MGP is a 95.5 rye, something like that. Uh, just from researching and watching other shows, mm. I think uh, MGP has a pretty standard rye mm. mash bill. I mean, like you said, Ken, the, the legs There's on this thing. I don't what know if we got back? Jen how this looks on this camera, but the legs, you guys can see it. It's, it's nice, it's got a nice color. Yeah, it, it really I, coats the I glass. love this stuff. I absolutely, out of all the ones we've had, I mean, this one, I just for some reason, I like the, the taste, the bite, the peatiness. Um, I don't get the peat. But see, I, I do, get the bite. I, yeah, I, I do. do. I don't. I, I get a lot of sweet huh. in there, which, I, you know, for the, yeah. the back end bite, it's got the front, mm. it's got a lot of sweet to it. 
It just reminds um, me so much of Lafroig. There's something there. There's yeah. there's like a yeah. I mean, I can I get it like back here that there's I see what you you would think it might be smoke or something. It's definitely it's got another. It's got it's very complex. It's got a lot of layers to it. You got some citrus. You got some cinnamon. You got some leather. Um, you got a little bit of mint maybe in there. It's just yeah, mint. Just yeah. The stuff. What was the price point on this day? Uh, I don't. You know, I. You were drunk. I, I, you know, I'd had a little bit of drink. I think I gave the guy a ridiculous tip on it, which I shouldn't have for giving me a bottle. Let's just say in the eighty to ninety range. Okay. And go from there. Um, it's, it's pretty good. It, it yeah. gives you. It's got a nice mouth feel to it. I mean, it's. Mm. I mean, that's all gone. It's great. I've never heard of Bone Snapper. I can tell you, but it's 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 good. It really is good. It's a good rye. Yeah. I mean, it's, it, it is to me. It's what a rye. Really, there, there's sweetness, but you really get that peppery. Yeah. But it's mild. It's mild going down. It's not too much of a smolder. It's just it's a really enjoyable drink. Uh, it's got a cool name. You got Mike Tyson on the side. I mean, yeah, I, yeah they definitely got the proof and the yeah. and the AB. Yeah, yeah, they got it backwards, but that's, backwards. that's okay. Yeah, I, 118. I, so basically, 119 proof. Yeah. Um, is that good, Jen? It's okay if they got it. <laughs> it's okay if they got it backwards. Okay. I ain't so good at math and stuff either so yeah it's all good so keeper dame hell yeah i love this one it's pretty good i love I, this one I would, I, yeah I, would, I i like it as well yeah so yeah yeah Thumbs so up. tune in next time guys thanks for watching and we're gonna end this one without any interruptions from the peanut gallery yeah <laughs> like Cheers. subscribe uh comment ring the bell let us know what you think if you've ever had uh bone snapper give us a shout yeah thanks for watching guys